Lady Lily back with another video. And this is a what what is in my bag video. What is in my bag video? I have not done one of these in a while. And um yeah, I'm transitioning um bags because um yeah, so I figure I'll do what's in my bag and an update on some items I got. So yeah. So it's a what's in my bag and like a uh leftover haul from the previous haul video. So we're gonna get started. So in my last video, I told y'all about getting the target items and supporting the black designers and stuff. So I said that I was in um I had um the Black History Month tote from Target en route. So I got it. So here she is. Um, I took her right out of the package and took her right to work. So um, this is the bag. Uh, and I said, this is gonna be also, this can be fitting cause it can roll into Women's History Month. So I took it to work the other day and I had a, a dance competition today. So when you, when I judge, I have to bring items. So it really worked out for me. So um, I'm liking this bag. Like, yeah, I'm liking this bag. And it's gonna go into Women's History Month, but it's very spacious. It's very um, sturdy and durable. I actually had, I don't have it in here now, but I had my binders in there, my, one of my binders that I need for my class. And I was able to squeeze my lunch. Uh, the pockets on the side, got the water bottles. So yeah, so I'm transitioning because I'm not going to carry this uh, for the next few days because I don't have to go to work and, and I mean, go into the office just yet. And like, like it's the weekend, so you want to downgrade. So I am going to transition from this bag, which is new. Um, I'm going to carry this bag. So in the old video, you remember I got this bag. And I always thought, why in the hell you just didn't get the large bag? I didn't think, I thought the medium was just as big. So I went with the medium, but it was like, damn, I should have got this in a large. And I said, well, if I get another one, I'll, I'll get a large one, but I'm not going to get it in the same color. So I said, I'll get another color. And I'm like, what would be a universal color to get? So, um... I end up getting it in black. And I had my eye on, especially during the Christmas times, because Glamaholics was doing like the 12 days of Christmas. So she had these different sales. So she ended up putting the blue bags like this for sale one day for $50. So you could get either size. You could get the small, you could get the medium or the large for $50, but only in blue. So blue must be her favorite color or she must be a Zeta or something, but... She had all these for 50 bucks, but only in blue. And I said, damn. So I was hoping that she was going to do like another special or something to, you know, for the 12 days of Christmas with the bucket bags, but she did stuff with the totes. She did not place the other bucket bags on, um, on the 12 days of Christmas list. So I said, I'll go ahead and get another one. I'll get black because black is universal. You can always use black. So this is what I'm going to transition my stuff into. So yeah, if you've seen one of Glamaholic videos with these bags, you've seen it. So I'm excited. Like I said, it's universal. black is universal. It can be dressed up, dressed down. Black go with everything. So yeah, so I got that in a uh, black tote. I mean, a black color. So I'll be switching my stuff out to put into that. So let's go ahead and get started. So... I got a clipboard um, when I go to cheer, um, dance, and cheerleading. Nine times out of ten, I serve as a technical judge in which we're looking for um, illegal moves, uh, pra practicing the safety um, features, uh, safety measurements to perform cheer and dance and that stuff. So usually I'm standing up, taking notes. So I usually have a clipboard, but 
I was a panel judge today and panel judges looking more for like chore choreography technique and stuff. So anyway, I just be uh, keeping my stuff together. So I had my clipboard, my rules book, my rubric, all that stuff that I need. So I just usually keep this like clipped. So when I need to grab it, I just grab it and don't think anything about it. So I just grabbed it. I didn't need the clipboard today, but just had it to have it. So that would not be going into the purse. Um, next, this is just a random folder I, I keep in my purse when I go to work. And I just have papers, flyers, or anything, um, my address labels. I keep that stuff in there. Um, yeah, it won't be going in this bag either, but um, that's just papers and stuff I might need to take around. So I keep them in this folder and I put them in my big purse. So we won't be needing that either. Um, next, that's in my bag is my um, journal. I'm using uh, AKA, um, my sorority journal. I got this back in October. Um, the president um, had treated us at the NPHC conference. So he had like, Gave us a little few dollars to go in the vendors. So I ended up getting this um, along with a pen. So um, this is the journal I am using. Um, and I put in here like um, just words of inspiration. My goals is in here. Um, scriptures, church notes, um, thoughts. Um, I put them down in here. Just positive things to keep me motivated and positive. That's what I, um, that's why I keep in here. So yeah, this will go into the purse. But yeah, church notes, all that good stuff. Um, I got a Dunkin' Donut receipt and I need to do the survey. So here's what I learned about Dunkin' Donuts. And it's nothing new, it's just, you know how they always tell the receipt. Uh, if you do the survey, fill out the survey, come back you can get you a uh, free donut with a medium or you know medium or a large drink so i started doing that and you know what you actually save money doing that because you are only paying for the drink and i was looking at the price of how much i would pay normally with the drink and a donut versus just buying a drink and it's like stretch my points and my gift card. Um, Cause I keep a loaded um, Dunkin' Donut card as well. It's like keep a loaded, uh, I try to not loaded, but just keep some money on a Starbucks card and Dunkin' Donut card. So, but I learned to do the survey. So I started doing the surveys and like now it's like, you know, unless the survey wrong, they give you the coupon for the free donut. So I start doing it and I just do it on the regular night and I give me a free drink and I mean a free donut and you know, the price that you would pay for just a medium drink is actually cheaper than the price of a small, small drink and a donut, which usually for me is like small hot latte with a donut, but I can get a medium, step my drink up to a medium and get a free donut. So I've been doing that. So I just do my surveys. Um, Next thing I got a Chase Bank sucker. I be taking these when they, because you know when the banks have not all the banks have them by the way, but that's the bank by my job. They um they had the suckers, so whenever they got the suckers, I, I take advantage. Um, this is actually my um pocket calendar that I like to keep. So um, this is small enough to put in any purse. So I like to have this one. And then I like this one because it actually goes for two years. It, it has, the, um, it goes from January, 2024 to December, 2025. So that's good. Cause, um, we're always looking ahead with events and things and yeah, so it doesn't hurt. It's like, as soon as you get a date, I get a date for something in 2025, I already put it down. So that way, you know, you can, you know, know how, how things are flowing and going. So yeah, I actually like this. That is two years. Cause you can look, look ahead. Um, 
Next thing I got is my gloves, which I really haven't been needing them lately. Um, I showed you these at Christmas time and I got these, this is like a two pairs of gloves. So I actually um, detached the other pair. So like this is good, like when you drive in and stuff. So I actually have these in my purse. I haven't been using them lately because the weather has been really mild for February. I mean, it snowed last night, um, but it was like halfway damn near melted almost today. So, I mean, still some little, you know, snow and frisk on the ground. But, yeah, I just been having these, you know, because I drive. So, yeah. So, I have these. I, they've just been in my purse. I really haven't put them out. I brought them out today, but really didn't need them. So, yeah, but I just keep them in the purse just in case. Um, next is my cosmetic bag. I'm just using, um, an AKA pouch. I had got this. I don't know what event I got this from. It might have been a luncheon. Might have been a luncheon. I'm thinking, was it a luncheon? I think it was a luncheon or something we had. Um, and I think it might have been virtual. And we had to come pick it up. But, yeah, I'm using this, um, AKA pouch right now because... I just need a little more room. And then I have my lotion, which I like that this can fit in there, but I think it's starting to run out. And then in my pouch, I just have like tissues from Jake from State Farm and uh, lotions, this same old mirror. Yeah, I remember this uh, mirror, lipsticks. Um, I have like a rollerball uh, perfume spray so i keep that in there i got a bath and body works body spray so i just spray it and use it up thousand wishes so i usually now all this stuff can't fit in here so i think i usually just keep the spray out but yeah that's my spray so this is going into the purse. Um, next, oh, uh, this is just some notes, some stuff I dropped, jot down. I gotta add that in my folder. Just some stuff I jot down. So that's not going into the purse. Um, I had my Hello Kitty calculator. I'm not putting this in my purse. But I use this because the competition that I judge today, they don't do the competition by um, computer. They do the traditional by paper. Um, they didn't want to pay for the, electro the electronic system set up. So, and I guess because it's not a lot of teams, they don't want to spend a lot of money. But um, I, I brought the calculator. Um, I brought the calculator so I can calculate my you know, points that I was putting on the judge sheet. So, and then this is my calcu uh, calculator I use to do my budget. I got this, I believe, off. I got this off of Amazon, I believe. So this is my Hello Kitty calculator. I love it. So, yeah, that won't be going into the purse. Um, I had this notebook. So this is just uh, writing down some stuff between work, life, um, so yeah, things to figure out. So yeah, this is, um, just, just throwing some stuff in here. That's what this notebook is about, but that's not going in. Um, and then this is my actual, um, uh, this is a calendar that I use. Um, that won't be going in either because I got the, um, this is like my big one. So this is just a regular, um, January to December um, calendar. I wanted something that wasn't big and bulky. Um, so yeah, I find this helpful. So, um, there's no need to get a real big and bulky, um, planner because this is doing what it does. So yeah, but that's not going in for the weekend. Um, next I got like a bunch of pens. And I think I took some of these pens off my desk from work. They need to go back because I probably ain't got no pens at work. So, got some pens. 
Um, I um, had this in there. So um, just because like today after the competition, I came home, I didn't want to bring this out. So I actually carried this to go run some errands um, today. And um, I got this from Macy's. You just saw this in my last video. This is so damn cute and dainty, right? So loving this. So what I had in here for my run around my errands today, um, I had my wallet, which you all, you all just saw this. So I tr I'm trying to, I, you can't put a lot of cash and stuff. If you don't want that bulky look, which that's what it's looking like, you can't put a lot of stuff in there, especially like with green dollar bills. Um, if you don't want that bulky look, it's not gonna work. If that's my debit card, I'm not gonna show y'all that. Um, this is receipt to Popeyes. I gotta scan my receipts because I get my points off of Fletch. So, uh, what else we got in here? This is a Walgreens receipt. I had to pick up my prescriptions. Um, this was my, this is my list of things I had to pick up and um, things I had to do. Like I had to go print some copies at Office Max. I did a return at Macy's. I'll talk about that shortly. Then I had to pick up a couple of things from Walmart. Um, another darn pen. I just wanted a little pen just in case I had to write down some, which I did. And then this is like my change and stuff from Walgreens. So I went through the drive through which I normally don't do. And I guess they put your change and stuff in the envelope because you know, they shoot it out. So she had it attached to my prescription bag. And so yeah, that's just my leftover change from, from the pharmacy. I got to put that in. Let me put this to the side. I'm gonna put this to the side for now. Alrighty. I got my Cooper's Hulk uh, wine club card. I just, I gotta get to Cooper's Hall. I got a gift card and I got about four or five bottles waiting me, waiting for me. I gotta get to Cooper's Hawk and have dinner. I was trying to have, use it and have dinner with somebody. So we shall see. I have two bottles of water. Shout out to these side pockets. Cause I had these two bottles of water um, this is the water they gave me at the competition and I had this in my bag from the other day, but shout out to these side pockets. They are very sturdy. They're actually sturdy if you have those like metal uh, water bottles to keep things cold. They actually is very deep and it's very um, round and this bag is um, form fitting. So, um, you know, this bag is form fitting so you can get a decent size bottle in these sides. I want some money in there, okay. So yeah, it's very deep. So yeah, that's, got a few more items. I got my plug, cause I gotta stay connected. Cause lately my phone just, I don't know if I've been on the phone too much, but shit's been dying. So I have to just keep a plug and a cord with me at all times. Now I feel like I gotta have a cord at work cord in the car, cord, uh, you know, of course, a cord in my purse, cord at home, but I'm using that to charge on my iPad. Got a comb. Um, what else I got in here? Got my, um, I just say official patch because I danced. Um, I finally was able to get a magnetic uh, snap to, to use this instead of I usually um, wear my blazer that got the patch, but now they changed the rules. They say you can wear all black now. So I was saying, let me wear some of my other clothes and don't have to always feel like I'm boggled down with the blazer. So I wore this, wore my black, I was able to snap my badge on and go do that. So I gotta put this up. Cause the season, for me, the season is officially over as of today. So 
I wrapped, did my last couple cheer and dance. So I'm set. Um, track, indoor track is going on right now. I'm not doing it. Um, I was teaching because I was teaching. I got another class session and my teaching, my class will be over for the term. I got a half term class. So um, the first half of the um, semester will conclude um, at the end of next week coming up. So March is the, the second half of the semester. So I taught what they call a term B, a term A course. So that's the first half. So the next, um, I'm not teaching anything for term B. I am gonna teach again in the fall, um, that one class that really goes the whole damn semester. And then I'm trying to see if I can get one of these um, part term classes. I'm gonna try to do two. So y'all pray for me. But um, nonetheless, the bag, the quilted bag, the bag I said like a bogus interlude to the YSL bag, I ended up taking that bag because I thought about it and I'm like, I had this coming in the mail. It came in the mail the other day. So it just didn't make sense to have the two different black bags. So I said, I'll take that back. So I went to Macy's, took that bag back. Um, still had leftover because I took that back, had leftover merchandise credit and star money because when you buy stuff with star money, they actually refund it to you, which is which is really nice. Um, so yeah, if you buy something with star money and you bring it back, they get the star money back to you. So I was able to get the star money back and um, the um, merchandise credit. So anyway, let me tell you what happened today. So I am really bad with sunglasses. So it would never make sense for me to buy no expensive ass glasses because I lose them, they break. So it never makes sense. So I was saying like, oh, it's gonna be time, you know. I said, you know, I need to get, I got like one or two pairs of sunglasses cause I done lost or broke the rest. So I was saying like, I was just looking at this, the purses and things, accessories, and they had the sunglasses thing. So check this out, I got, these glasses, which is cute. These are Jessica Simpsons, right? And then I got these, which was Sean John's, right? Cute, right? And they part, they about the same, but hell, like I said, I lose and break them. So it's okay to have dupes duplicates because, but they're slightly different. Like the sides are slightly different, but yeah. Anyway, so y'all know what the stuff going on with Diddy and everything. So, you know, Macy's like discontinued their partnership with Sean John, but we ain't really seen no Sean John clothes in about a good 10 years, right? Right? 10, maybe 15 years or what? I know I ain't seen them, but anyway. They, these glasses was marked down. So these are the Jessica Simpsons, right? They was marked, it was only like six bucks. Now these glasses, regular price probably would have been like, outside of the Marshalls, you know, the regular price would have been $50, right? They had these for $6.98, right? So like I said, they must be, they did away with Sean John, Diddy, and all these. Why I got these glasses for 96 cents? I looked on the receipt. It said 96 cents. So I don't know if they said you bought, cause both of these were marked down. So I don't know if they was like, if you buy one, you get one dirt cheap, or maybe they were just saying, we trying to get Diddy the hell out the store, but these were 96 cents. You can't beat this. So now I won't feel bad if I lose these, cause they was only 96 cents, right? So I was just like, yeah. 
And then, I was in there like a few days ago. I did not see this. They had the heart purses from Guess, right? They had the heart. So they came in different colors. They had pink, black, and they had red. But we weren't getting no red. Black, I didn't get the black because I already had this. So I said, it don't make sense to get black. So I said, as always, what AKA cannot go without having something pink? So I got this for pink. So they had just marked this down. And then I had, I think they say, you use your Macy's. I had Star. And I had more merchandise credit. So this purse would have normally been what? $88. Got it for like $27 with all the coupons and incentives. You cannot beat that. And it's really cute. It's really cute. And it's fitting. Because like, like I said, I'm trying to do things when I got to go run out real quick. You know, you don't want to carry a big and bulky bag. So, I'm getting more into crossbodies. So, and they stuff this stuff to all be damn. I mean, do you got enough paper in there, but... Dang. I got all this stuff in here. So, this is the inside. And I love that they got these card slots because if you just got to go somewhere real quick and you don't want to bring a big big purse you know um yeah you can slide your card some dollars your keys i think my phone will fit in here i'll have to check it out because i use my phone to film so yeah but i thought it was cute it'll come in handy we'll use it needed this for valentine's day even though i ain't do nothing for valentine's day so but yeah i like the chain so that is cute. So yeah, nice. So that is gonna be it. I don't foresee myself getting anything else right now. Um, I'm getting ready for my sorority conference that's popping up. So um, might get some things there, but it's gonna have to be something different because I learned going, you go to these conferences, like you be saying the same old stuff. So people who are new members, or young, like a year, and they go buy up all the stuff. But once you get in the sorority more maturely, you be like, okay, what's different? I need something different. So it's like, yeah, that's where I'm at with um, buying stuff in the vendors. But I do have some shopping to, uh, one of my friends just became a Zeta. So I'm sure they're gonna have a Neo fight or something. So I was saying, maybe I can get some for her. And then some other people might be coming down the pipeline with some memberships in the future. So I can shop for them. But yeah, I just got me a little list of stuff I want to get throughout the years because I'm trying to curb the shopping, even though it don't look like it. But it's really, like I said, some of that stuff, like I said, I had merchandise credit. Yeah. This, but I did take stuff back, so I do do that. So, anyway, I'm going to stop laughing because this video is getting close to 30 minutes. So, that is it. That is all. Like, comment, subscribe. Stay tuned for more videos. Oh, I think I'm going to do a video about the Wendy Williams documentary. I watched that part one tonight. I'm like, oh, boy. So, um... Yeah, Wendy's not good, y'all. So, um, I might come on and do a video. They showing part two tomorrow. So, I'll probably come on and do a little something, something about that. Take care. Like, comment, subscribe. Stay tuned for more videos. Peace out.